Hi everyone, I'm your host Maddie and tonight I'm at the premiere of Night Swim. Hey everyone, you're watching Maddie's Moments and I'm here with... Bryce McGuire, director of Night Swim. How are you? I am cold but wonderful. This is your director directorial debut. How does it feel? Oh man, look around. All this, this backdrop, the pool here, we're standing over the water. This is, it's, it's a dream come true. It feels amazing. Yeah. You also wrote Night Swim. What is so cool is it started out as a five-minute short film in 2014, and now it's 2024, and it's your feature film. What furthered the story along? Time, um, being patient with it, thinking about it, making sure that there was enough, uh, enough of mystery, uh, enough... Enough, enough of a story there where it wasn't just repeating the same gag from the short film again and again and again. I, I hope that people go into this movie, maybe you've seen the trailer, and you're like, I think I know what that is. You probably don't. There's, there's, there's more beneath the surface there, and I'm excited for people to experience that on the big screen this weekend. Tell us about the family dynamic in this film. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's in a way like a classic American family. It's a family that we're, we're rooting for. They're trying to, you know make a better life for themselves and each of the family members the pool gives them some version of their dream it offers something to them um and you know it's a family that's like put through hell in a way they're they're tested by the the crucible of this pool and what it um what it comes at them with and yeah is the pool in every shot in this film the pool is not in every shot in the film no we actually yeah we definitely expand beyond that most of but not all of the scares take place in some way around the pool but but not all yeah. i also heard you have a cameo in the film i do have a cameo in the film uh am i allowed to say i guess it's not out there yeah i um i had to do some basic dive training um and breath holding training and uh i am one of the uh drowned drowned entities uh, and the pool, and you can if you look, if you squint hard enough, you can see me back there swimming around. So it's exciting. And there's also some Easter eggs for possibly night swim too. There is, you know, we got to see obviously like what people you know do this weekend and and how how it's received. But I definitely feel like the pool is like the tip of the iceberg, and it was always kind of designed to be like even in the night swim, it's not just the the pool. Literally, there's there's kind of more to it than that. And I think that opens up the door for like, oh, whoa, what else is down there? And what other time periods did that take place? And what other, what other places does that power touch beyond this one backyard? And how is it working with Jason and the cast? Um, it, was, it was amazing. I mean, both James Wan here, my friend, and, and Jason, two, two of the best producers making horror films, period. Um, really of all time in horror. Um, so I, I'm so lucky to have them, you know, shepherding this project and supporting me and the cast, you know, it's, it's, they're, they're all incredible. I'm so proud of getting to pull this cast together. They are the characters. They, they add so much to the movie. So I, I feel so lucky. It's a good question. What emotions do I feel the audience? Do I want the audience to feel, um, joy, terror, suspense, nausea, elation. Dizziness, cold sweats, hot sweats, <laughs> fatigue, uh, and and uh, and dancing. Well, I'm so excited for this film. Congratulations, and have a great night. Thank you so much. Everyone see Night Swim in theaters everywhere starting tomorrow night. And uh, bring friends. Do not see this movie alone. Thank you so much. You're watching Maddie's Moments, and let's be your moment too. Bye. Thank you. You're watching Maddie's Moments.